Now back on GTA 5 online. Holy shiz. I love this game. It's so good. And this car. Oh my god, the scratch. Oh no. But um, today what I'm going to be doing is sort of like a tutorial on how to actually replace cars in your garage. So, like, once you I can't really explain it, but once your garage is full, then you might think, you know, that's it. That you can't get rid of any, you can't sell. Because, um, you can't actually sell cars you buy if they're above 50 grand, I think. So, uh, that's pretty much all my garage. So, you know, I was panicking. I was like, oh my god, I've only got, like, one space left. And then, once it was filled up, I sort of, like, tried to put a car in. And then it did something that I didn't know that it would do. So, let me just mark my, my garage here. Uh, there we go. Oh, turn around. So, what, what it does, it allows you to destroy a car that you already have. Like, meaning, um, you can destroy cars you bought. You can destroy cars that, you know just random but I, I didn't actually know this so let me I'll find a car here we'll get we'll get that one and then I'll show you what I mean but um you know I'm, I'm telling you this so you don't have to sort of like panic you know to save space because like I said when I when I had like one space I saw like crap oh my god I can't sell any cars can't get rid of any but um once you go just full it sort of like lets you destroy them so I'll, I'll show you I'll show it I'll show it so now we're at the garage, once I go and like try and put it in, it'll say your garage is full, as you can see. Your garage must be replaced and you'll go to store your current vehicle and then just press OK. As soon as you press OK, you have to get rid of a car or the car you're in will get destroyed. So that's a bit of a, a, bit of a bummer. I don't think, I don't know if this works with, um, you know, if you buy a car from the websites and then it might like, sort of ask you to destroy it. I'm not sure if that works or not. I actually tried that. I ain't going to try it because I'm actually going to buy the Ferrari because I have... 200k which I was saving up for all last night oh my god it took ages so um what it should do now yeah here we go we get a list that says replace vehicle now I can choose which um which one I want to replace now if you don't know the names of them then you're pretty screwed but I, I know I know, pretty much know all the names the elegy is the, the Nissan over there the um, red one black one top right but uh, as you can see here sting your GT which is destroyed now this was really weird it's sort of like it duplicated it I'm not really it was it was really really weird but um that's that's the thing of duty that red one right in the middle right there as you can see but um, if I just press A on that then you'll be able to see if you want to replace vehicle and then it'll go right there like I said it was destroyed so that's really about it it's very simple so you don't have to panic when you have like one space left my yellow card goes there so I've pretty much got a full garage now now I'm probably gonna get rid of um that blue one and maybe this yellow one because I don't know they just seem out of place and I don't really like them because I, I, don't, I don't really go for the super cars as you can see my garage is like it's very mixed I've got one super car over there the, the Mura the Mura whatever it's called <laughs> Lamborghini I don't, I don't know what it's actually called in the game <laughs> weird but uh, if you enjoyed the video it helped you out remember to hit that like button subscribe if you're already not and I'll see you guys next time